I give you the Steady Typex Pros. Um, I'm sure you can agree with me, these lights need no introduction. Um, what I would like to make uh, very clear to you guys, I'm in no way affiliated um, in any capacity to Steady. I came across their products somewhat about four years ago now, um, and I've used their products um, ever since. Um, I've really got behind their ethos and their no BS approach to providing world-class products um, at affordable prices. Um, and I'm sure you can agree with me that's something we can all get behind. Um, we're going to break, sort of break it down today and we're going to have a look at several different factors such as um, the design. Uh, we're going to have a look, looks in cosmetics and ultimately we're going to look at the price as well um, and what that obviously means to your pockets. So firstly, the, the design, um, I'm sure you can agree, these things are nothing short of a work of art. These things are fantastic looking lights. I've had my eyes set on these um, for quite some time and I'm very, very um, stoked to finally have a set. And these things are incredible, um, which you'll see um, shortly in the video. I'll show you the power of these lights. Um, the great thing about obviously the steady light is you can you can customize them to your specific needs to your your you know your requirements either you have a theme going on in your build um, or if it's just something that you really like um, you can pretty much do that so you can change the the color rings um, to various different colors just have a look in their website so they've got an amazing array of different designs you can apply um, along with the, the the covers as well so you can either choose the iconic smiley face um, or you can go for the, the general branded sort of steady logo um, or a variety of colored uh, lenses which is very very handy um, it doesn't uh, it helps with the obviously a lot of night driving if you do a lot of night driving it does help with sort of uh, relaxing your eyes and doesn't sort of stress the eyes out um, with the the white light at all times now moving on to the design of the light. now this goes hand in hand with the cosmetic side of things um, and they've done a fantastic job job by combining everything together and just the overall product has come out really really well so we'll look at the key features such as the brackets now this is a 10 mil aluminium high pressure die cast bracket um, aluminium nice and light um, keeps the weight down but it's super strong um, and it has especially for those corrugations that you may experience around the world um, and they've been designed for basically that in mind for prolonged exposure to corrugations um, you know, for you know, lengths of time, uh, which is really handy and something that is you, you paying the amount of money for lights. And um, the last thing you need them is is failing, especially on the brackets. Those are the obviously the um, one of the most important things for these lights is to keep them nice and secure on your vehicle. And you can imagine something like this coming off your vehicle. Uh, it's going to be pretty expensive. Um, yeah, and it's not the the greatest thing that you'd like to happen. So. Um, what they've done is they complemented the bracket with a brushed stainless steel um, shoulder plate on the side which, like I said, it, it really encompasses the design and the cosmetics and it brings it all together and it looks really, really cool. Um, stainless steel bolts, um, nuts and bolts used all round, um, again, eliminates that, that, um, that issue with rust that we have. Um, as four-wheel drivers, we're going through obviously a lot of you know water, river crossings, all that kind of stuff. So it eliminates that sort of factor, um, which is super handy. And that's along with the all the, the bolts all the way around the front face of the light, um, along the mounting and the adjustment areas, um, and the and the, the bolts used to mount uh, the light to the bumper, um, which is really cool. So you don't have to worry about any rust, any of that kind of thing. Um, in terms of the design as well, you can see the sheer size of these lights um, and you can imagine the amount of technology that's been crammed in these lights. Um, it's, it's just very, very impressive. Um, one thing that I really like about these, these lights, obviously, the, is the interchangeable covers. They easily just pop straight off and exposes the optical lens. Um, we'll get to that in a second. And as easy as they are to take off, they're just as easy to put back on as long as you line up. The, the tabs with the locators up in the, in the suitable areas. Hopefully I get this right. There we go, nice and simple. And then, you know, you can change the, the lenses. So if these get damaged or broken, um, you can change these. Or if you want to change for obviously a, uh, a colored version, you can do that as well. So nice and simple just to pop off. Now, exposing the optical lens, um, you can she see the sheer size of these lights. Um, I think these are eight and a half inch, uh, almost such nine inch lights. Um, they have 31 pencil beams and six um, 
spread is in the, in the middle. So what this focuses on is a maximum amount of light throw for the driver um, and giving them sort of an unrivaled experience um, with light, um, especially with uh, types of spotties. And if you're doing a lot of long distance night driving, uh, these things are absolutely fantastic. Um, and they have kicked my light bars into the next dimension in terms of the amount of light um, these things produce, which is incredible. Now, the optical lens itself, um, this is made out of a um, very similar sort of ballistic material. Um, so virtually indestructible um, in terms of getting uh, hit by stones and rocks, all that kind of stuff. So, um, which is, it's, you know, it's a great peace of mind um, for your lights as well. So um, fantastic. And what you'll see on the back of the, the light as well, it has a vent on the light, what uh, a, lot, a lot of lights that I've seen, especially the cheap ones, they don't have any vents and they tend to condensate inside uh, due to obviously different sort of conditions. Um, whereas this is has the vent and be able to sort of equalize the pressure and get rid of any condensations that may build up um, in the light in you know, various different um, extreme weather conditions. So last but not least, uh, we want to touch on, on a little bit about the wiring um, of these lights. And again, Steady have paid close attention to the wiring side of things um, by using high quality DH plugs throughout the, the, most of the connections, um, really good relays, and they've sized the cables to suit the sheer power draw of these lights. Um, each light um, draws 10.4 amps, so as a pair, they draw 21 amps. Um, and as you can imagine, they'll give any battery a good flogging. Um, and like I mentioned before, these spotlights have basically kicked my light bars um, into the next dimension in terms of the sheer light that these um, spotlights put out. So very, very impressed, um, which is a, a complete understatement. So hats off to the guys at Steady. They've done an incredible job um, bringing all the design, the cosmetics, the quality and that no BS approach uh, to providing a world-class light um, at an affordable price um, to you and I is just is brilliant and it's you know hats off to the guys so well done to that um, to get your hands on a set of these lights it's going to set you back 690 Australian dollars um, and to convert that uh, back to pounds if you are here in the UK uh, it's about 380 pounds and that's excluding any shipping or customs charges um, but I'm sure you can agree that a pair of these lights of this quality and this calibre uh, for that good of a price, um, it, it's really, really good. Very, very impressive. Um, they're very, very competitively priced, in my opinion, uh, compared to a lot of other sort of brands on the market. So I'm very, very impressed um, with these lights, to say the least. Thank you for getting this far in the video guys, I really, really appreciate it. And if you've liked the video, please hit that thumbs up, it really helps the, the video grow. Um, and if you haven't already done so, please consider subscribing to the channel. Um, the content's absolutely free, um, and hopefully you enjoy the content I bring you. Um, and if, if you don't, then fair enough. Um, but please let us know down below with any comments or suggestions that you might have for future videos. Um, and if you have, if you're running any different lights, uh, let me know what sort of your thoughts are on the St Steady Type X Pros, or if you're running any other sort of branded lights, I'd, I'd be keen to hear what you guys are running and what you guys think of these particular lights or the lights that you may be running. But uh, without further ado, guys, I hope you enjoy the content we're providing, and we will definitely see you in the next one. If I'm not back in five minutes, just wait longer.